if you have a kitchen that's always like, all right, you know, it's not sort of like, hey, like, what the fuck is this? This is wrong, you know? You have to do this again and just kind of bashing people, you know? And then they're just like robots and they just like replicate and replicate and replicate. Uh -huh. But if you have an open, if you keep an open conversation, you're sort of like, hey, this, um, the sauce tastes kind of sweet. Like, what's the reason, you know? And you kind of look at it and you realize the onions are a lot sweeter than they usually are, you know, because produce changes. Uh -huh. And you just have an open conversation. It's sort of like, hey, maybe we should do it like this tomorrow. And then like what you have is like people coming to you and they're saying like, hey, chef, like, look, this is like this today, you know, um, what should we do? And you talk with them in, uh, in a very relaxed manner and in a very flexible way. Your chefs are going to develop further. There's a very organic progress for them also professionally because they learn more and more, right? And it improves the quality of everything massively, but also, you know, the whole vibe of the restaurants, yeah. you know, we have a restaurant where there's an open kitchen, you know, and it's hard work and everybody works super hard, but at the same time, we're like relaxed and nobody's angry. And like, we just, we're organized to a point where the amount of work is like manageable without it being, you know, a pain. And we go from day to day trying to improve from day to day, you know, and I feel like people feel that.